Ladies and gentlemen, I have fallen off. <laughs> to the screen, to the ring, to the pen, to the kick. All right, hello everyone. Today is, I guess, to, to open up this like little video that I got going on here. You guys know the term best revenge is no revenge. With every situation, I like to lean on that because I, I don't think there's any point of trying to, you know, uh, try to get back at someone. So anything that might, you know, justify revenge, I just don't go for it. And it's just not that kind of lad, you know what I mean? But, um, point is, it's <laughs> just me sucking my own schmeat here. But I've talked about the whole KSI and Dan TDM stuff for the past, you know, for the past week, week and a half now. Dan TDM has made two tweets now, coming from a couple days ago, actually. So I'm a little bit late to this, but in between these two tweets, KSI has been like, you know, going off the deep end here with the, with the rage bait. And he's finally starting to break. He's like, he's actually like, I guess getting annoyed with everything. This is one of the tweets that he said here. What it says is generational haters everywhere. I'm so tired of it at this point. Just leave me alone. See, I don't know if this is all part of the plan or what, but I don't know. Dan TDM tweets this a couple days ago. Living my best life him with his kids. Just a wholesome slash funny tweet. Just the big Dan the Diamond minecart having fun with his kids, man, that's it. And for some reason, I guess, I don't know if this, how true this is from him. I don't know how genuine this is, but he goes, happy for you, bro. To the screen, to the ring, to the pen, to the cake. You know what I just thought of, ladies and gentlemen? Why not go all out at the gym today, right? On top of the leg day, why don't we just do every part of the body. Well, not every part of the body, but whatever I feel like for the top half, right? Bottom half, I'm gonna keep it to, you know, the usual, but the top half, I'm just gonna see what I wanna do, and I'm just gonna go for it. Obviously, the scientific way of doing it. Recovery is very important, all right? And yes, I, I, I am a big advocate of that. However, let's, let's try something different today. I'm just gonna go all in, and I'm just gonna, <laughs> I, just, I, I don't know why I'm doing this. Just gonna go full body and, uh, See how it goes. And on top of that, we're gonna be using a stim pre-workout. Yeah, go go balls in, or balls, balls, balls deep. Yeah, all right. I'm still holding on to everything that's dead and gone. Now you're in the stars and six feet's never felt so far. You took the best of my heart, oh. Ladies and gentlemen, I have fallen off. <laughs> you guys remember this spot right here where I would talk about whatever I wanted? Most of the time I would have a drink with me. So, you know what? Let's keep the tradition going and we're gonna have a drink with me. <laughs> we're gonna drink some... I don't know, some... some... Some sparkling water. I'm gonna talk about me falling off. For those of you over the age of 40, um, falling off means a decline. When I talk about falling off, I'm talking about my channel specifically when it comes to stats, um... Hell, even upload schedule at this point. Uh, yeah, I'm just pretty much gonna go over everything that, you know, that, that happened and, and why things are the way it is right now. And I might not be addressing everything, but, but this is the stuff that I can think of off the top of my head. So, I mean, without further ado, let's get right into the fall off. Hey, irrelevant. So with just a quick look at the channel, it is really easy to see that it, it, it hasn't been doing like what it used to be doing. I'm talking about views wise, interact likes wise, well that comes with interaction. Subscribers wise, it really hasn't done the greatest. Ever since 3000 subscribers, it's, I don't know what it is, it just made a, it, it just started to make a decline. I thought of a few things that could potentially go into that and I just want to blabber on afterwards about like how I want to like improve and how I want to put it back you know it's 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 been derailed here recently I want to put it back on its rails and ride off into the sunset and everything but although I guess my Lunchables videos you know it's doing all right but compared to what I used to get I, I used to clear 200 views 300 views four or 500 views each video around August or no sorry around July, June, July, June, July, that was my peak. The stats were up, everything was up, the content was great. It was a lot of positives and barely any negatives. So I guess for those of you that are new to my channel, um, I'm talking about like a few months ago where, <coughs> sorry, <laughs> around the fair time, every single video would clear over 300 views, which it's not much, obviously in the grand scheme of things, but for, for a channel like me and you know, for a channel my size, it's great. And I completely understand. I'll talk more about this later, but the content was at its best. 
around that time. When it comes from, you know, the the fair videos, the, the new edition of the fishies, the new edition of, you know, the mic'd up videos and everything. For a while there, it was, it was great. But then it started falling off a little bit. Irrelevant! The views started to decline. I had a pretty good resurgence for a while there. I did a pajama review. This was one of my weaker videos. And then I did a Our Crumble Cookies Overrated video. It's time for bulking season video. And then the underwear review. Those four videos in a row were were good, all right? 2,000 views, you know, a thousand, over a 1,000 views on each of them, except for the underwear review, but... And then it started to just decline. Get us your boy, eat that and this is where we're at. The videos are hovering around 100 views, less than that. It hasn't been the best. I'm, I'm not gonna, you know, not gonna deny that. And I think it's for a good reason. I guess let's get into the reasons why, right? I need to do something with this so I can put it into the middle part, but not right now. All right, not right now. What the fuck's cracking with it? One of the things that started the fall off was um, me skipping videos. Instead of just uploading a vlog, I would make like a one minute video where I, I talk about why I don't have the video. For the majority of the time, or no, I think every single time. It's because I got drunk the night prior. The first one that I did was a video called My Bad. And that was three months ago. That was me saying that I had a bit of a blast the night prior. I didn't do it for a while. I got back into it and that's when the channel started like genuinely doing its best, right? A little bit of time passed by. Haven't skipped a single one. I was absolutely on the grind for this. Then again, it happened. Right when my channel did like a resurgence after the first like phase of the falling off. After the underwear review video, I made a video called I have made a severe and continuous lapse in my judgment. And that's just me pretty much addressing that. Hey, I just had another blast of a night so i'm sorry and not too long after that two days later did it again or no the video that i made called here's what happened that was actually about um like a glitch uh like in, in sony vega so it, was, it wasn't my fault but the point still stands it wasn't a vlog it was a short video explaining and it, it was worthless right which fun fact this was the first video in two months three months that didn't break over 100 views so pretty much this is where like the fall off started or the second phase of the fall off and then a little bit of time uh, passed by i made a video called i made a mistake this was me waking up late and i just instead of uh instead of making a short video i learned my lesson and i was just like you know what i'm gonna upload this you know uncut mukbang video which this was also when i started doing more mukbang videos so anything that was over 30 minutes around this phase was um was a mukbang video and it was completely unedited you know why is because it was easy that gave me time to enjoy hanging out with the boys more this is when i started getting lazy so when I started getting lazy, that was when the video started, just kept falling off even more, right? And then more time passed by, my video called Today's Vlog will be up at 8pm CT. Now this, this is another fall off. I don't want to show that on Around this time was when I started to upload the videos in a very scattered schedule, right? I would upload videos at like 8pm, I would sometimes upload videos at 12. It's gotten to the point now. A fast forward where I upload videos sometimes at three in the morning, two in the morning. That's mainly because I'm behind, right? I'm behind on videos and I don't ever want to go back to making like a like a two minute video of me explaining, right? That's one of the main reasons why. Ever since then, I haven't made like a video that's like a throwaway video. Now, these are the things that I, I think, like, you know, it, it's under my control. This is my bad, right? So I've already mentioned inconsistent upload times. I've already mentioned the new schedule, which there really isn't a schedule at this point. Sometimes I upload videos like two in a row or I miss a day. I've technically failed the series already, but I don't want to say that because I still upload, you know, every single day, technically. I was scrolling through my goddamn phone. Not long enough videos. Uh, you'll notice I've started to become more, uh, what's that called? What's the, what's the word called? Uh, I've started to become more, I don't even know how to say it. I guess to put it into simple terms, I guess lazy. Yeah. That's, that's really it. A lot of these videos that are, sh like, really short, uh, it's because of the new schedule that I've been trying to do. I'd be editing at, like, right before the gym. You know, it's kind of a race against time because I don't want to go to the gym too late. So, I, you know, I edit before the gym. I want to make the edit time as short as possible. So, that leads the video to becoming short. Simple maths. We are on a goddamn path! Winning. Another thing is that like the videos are just not as interesting as they used to be. If you look at videos from like two months ago, three months ago, well specifically three months ago, compare a video from very recently to three months ago, you'll see the big difference. Which ties me into this uh, next point 
uh, passion. I've lost a little bit of passion with this. Uh, it start. I guess the the passion kind of started. There's a video that I made like about a month ago. It's called Burnout. That's when the the passion kind of started like going away. It sucks because I I want to entertain you guys and I want to make sure that the videos are high quality but i just gotta find it again this video is gonna be the start of it i think i just want to enjoy making videos again there's this big block that's been happening recently this is like the main reason and you guys can see it in the videos too uh but before that i want to also say uh no video ideas which i don't even want to say that because i have so many video ideas i just gotta start doing them right yeah point is there's been one thing that's the main reason as to why everything's just been kind of a fall off well there's also another thing but that's it's all done now so it's 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 out of the equation but the main reason is going out that's really what's been leading to the downfall i think that's the main reason for the downfall and whose fault is it it's no one else's it's mine right and i'll take the blame for it obviously it makes no sense if i blame anyone else it is my own decision to do the stuff that i do it is my own decision to go out it's my own decision to be irresponsible i've lost a good amount of passion for this because of you know the distractions right meeting a new set of friends specifically these the, like these guys that i've met recently bless them they're good people but it just led me to just careless about this which in the beginning of the year was my main priority your guys's entertainment your guys's time is you know uh, has been my priority for the longest time it's been such a big difference because even the last time uh or sorry even throughout summertime i'd go to the fair i'd do all this like i would still stay up until god knows until like 8 a.m in the morning especially the fair videos i would stay up until like 8 a.m in the morning to just edit until the video's done just so i can upload it at 12 a.m that was the passion that was my peak passion of this whole thing that that was my i was at my mojo right there right? and did it take a lot of my time and did it take a, a little bit of toll on my mental health yes it did but i justified it as being oh like i got these all these people to entertain i can't i can't break this now i can't this i can't stop this now i put you guys first and i didn't put myself first and now it's the extreme opposite i've put myself first and i just I just neglected you guys, man. I'm trying to find a balance. I'm trying to find a balance to where I can make entertaining videos for you guys consistently, but also have my time, you know, outside and stuff. Because for those of you that don't know, I, I don't really go outside like that. And this year has been like my first year of genuinely doing that kind of stuff. Unfortunately, it's it's been collateral damage because you guys are getting hurt from it. Like hurt as in like, you know, you guys are just not seeing good content. I want to go back. I want to go back to, you know, not the other extreme end where I, I put just you guys first, but I want to find a balance. I don't know how to do that. I, I'm just going to have to, I don't know. It's something that I'll just have to figure out myself. And, and I will. This has turned into such like a sob fest, but I'm just, I'm just really, this is me. Like, this is me being like the most transparent that I've been in a while of course i care about the, the interactions the views all that kind of stuff but most importantly i care about y like if you guys enjoyed the videos and from the looks of it, it it doesn't seem like you guys have been entertained by the videos and that's my fault i don't want to disappoint you guys anymore so i'm not gonna say everything's gonna be perfect after this but just know i'm gonna be trying my hardest i guess another thing as well i had this in my notes uh it, this is like on the section that oh changes that i i you know i myself can't control i put school starting as one of the reasons why i haven't been getting as much like interactions as, or whatever recently but after genuinely thinking about it and like talking about it to you guys it doesn't matter it really doesn't matter it's it's on me and this isn't a pity party for me this is just i don't know like me living with my decisions this is me you know reaping the uh reaping the not the benefits but the i don't know like I, i'm trying to make it sound like I'm a big intellectual but i'm just saying like you know you you make your bed that you lay in that type of thing it's not gonna be a perfect thing i'm not gonna be straight back into 12 p.m uploads and banger videos every single day but i will try to improve and i will get back into track and I have a few ways of balancing everything out, but I just, uh, just, just, I just need some time. <laughs> this is, what a talk this has been. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you for everything that you guys have done for me. You know, I mean, I'll see you guys tomorrow anyway, so thank you guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Uh
Turn around. No, I got a heart. Begging me to go, but I tell her to stop it. Always got the key, and my heart is the lock. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like a pro, but you're really a novice.